so what are we doing this weekend, my absolute bros? Where it is, there's some pretty freaking rad solar events going on around campus. Like what, my doggies? I'm talking solar flare, solar jets, solar winds. And if we're so freaking lucky, my dogs, there might even be a coronal mass ejection. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy. Frosh, how many solar events have you been to, man? None, actually. My absolute doggy boyfriends. Oh, what? what? Dude, we gotta get you oriented. Yeah, you have so much to learn and experience, Froshy Boy 2000. Thanks, brochachos. Where do I even start? So, the sun is constantly moving, spinning, and hardcore partying, <laughs> like, all the freaking time, you know? But like not in one piece. Like the equator is spinning faster than the poles even. So it's like doing all sorts of wacky things that make for great solar events popping up left and right. Yeah, like at any given time, there might be several solar events that are similar, but like different, but it's such a freaking party. <laughs> Sounds so wild, my duties. What are your favorites? So like, Solar prominences? Those are big loopy loops that follow the sun's magnetic fields. When you can see the loopy, that's called a prominence. When you're looking at the loopy in a way where it's just like a line, then it's called a filament. So they're the same thing? Yeah, bro, they're just like subtle nuances in the way they appear from the outside, you know? Totally. Solar jets. If we hit up a jet, we gotta down some Red Bulls first because they take up a lot of energy. Yeah, like a sudden huge burst of energy and they're shaped like a big old pencil. Okay, but my fave is a solar flare. Three words, high energy radiation. Once, I went to a solar flare that was so hardcore that it blacked out a bunch of radios in Australia, my kangaroos. Are you serious? Yeah, man. Solar events are sometimes so lit, they totally affect Earth, like coronal mass ejections. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, but those big old bubbles on the sun can totally cause auroras on Earth. My mom saw the Northern Lights in Sweden two years ago, and they totally inspired her meditation routine. Oh, huh, absolute game changer. Yeah, dude, but speaking of meditation, if I'm totally being honest with y'all right now? I certainly hope so, because honesty is the first rule of bro code. Absolutely, my toad, let it out. I'm kind of feeling like I just want a chill night. Can we just like hit up a sunspot and sip some kombucha with some healing face masks and the slightly lower tab? Oh, squirt. Sounds so freaking thoughtful, dude. I love it. Yeah, I have my whole college career ahead of me to learn how to party hard and figure out my party needs and boundaries. Chill nights with the bro fam are just as important. All for one? And, and sons, sons for all! all. Yeah.